All right, there's a lot of great Chardonnays out there, but <laughs> sometimes you find one that has something unique and different, a unique and different flavor that is really outstanding and appealing, and that's what this 2009 Starmont from Napa Valley, it has a tangerine flavor in it. Yes, it and does. You just don't see that in a Chardonnay every day. I mean, it has all kinds of other great elements and other flavors in it, but that tangerine it comes, sends it into some And it comes through crystal clear. Yes. It's a really interesting thing in just the right way. This, I mean, you, ta you don't taste tangerine in this. You don't have taste buds. And yet, <laughs> all the other elements are in there, the butter and the et cetera. And let's just well, go let's back to back it. I want to remember yeah. it all. Mm, God, super clean, so no good. dirty bunk, everything. So just, good. Just bright and clean. And then, there you go. Tangerine galore. Mm. I get, the other nice thing is there's some nice other things rounding this out. There's tro There are tropical fruits in there, and there's a nice layer of oak. So you've got a nice roundedness, but then yeah. you get those citrus things. Yeah, there's, and of course, no, there's a little bit of butter, but also there's some peach and yeah. nectarine in this yeah. one. Yeah. Really all That's together. That's it. It is super bright, super clean, super delicious. Yeah. Now let's talk value for a second. All right. It's a sixteen dollar wine, so it's not that cheap. But the flavors in this wine are because they're so complicated and so unique. It elevates it back up to that fine wine category. It's really true. It's rare to have this nice balance of uh, of of really different citrus. The tangerine element in this really is what kicks this up into a fine wine category because you've got all the other fine wine elements. You've got the tropical notes. You've got the pear. You've got the oak and butter. Butter, although not a lot of butter, more fresh, juicy fruit sitting yep. in here, but layered and structured. And it is just, it kicks it up into the, where are we gonna go? Well, it's we're a 20 to $25 wine, yeah. no doubt about it. Not a, I think not we're going to the sort of the top end of that range. I think we're at 24 bucks. Okay, so we're gonna cut it off 25, go 24. Yeah, just, uh, just to be safe. Our usual. Yeah. And, uh, and, that's, and that's what you've got here. You got a fine wine, a unique, flavor profile, maybe not unique. Unique means there's only one of them. And okay, maybe it's gonna happen again, but it's very rare and it's absolutely delicious. This yes. wine is fresh as fresh can be and still structured, layered, and balanced. And let's just do it. Two yeah. thumbs up to the Starmont 2009 Napa Valley Shard. Mm. Man, I love that. <laughs> that is love that. really good. Love it.